So, I'm uh, Paul Krischer. I'm a Drupalist from the Netherlands. Uh, I live in Harlem, just west of Amsterdam. And I've been doing Drupal for over 10 years now. Just had my Drupalversary uh, for, uh, for 10 years, just a few weeks ago. Um, and I've been going to quite a few Drupal camps and cons and other Drupal events all over Europe. Uh, I've actually met my girlfriend in Drupal Con London in 2011. So, and she was not the first nor the last Drupalist that I've met over the years. So there's quite a few familiar faces here in Drupal Camp London as well. I've really enjoyed myself. Drupal Camp London, it's, it's, it's quite large. You have over 500 people, I heard somebody say, which is really impressive. Uh, uh, I, don't th I think that makes us one of the larger non-DrupalCon events here in Europe. So that's really good. I see a really nice mixed crowd, lots of diversity. New Drupalists, really uh, old veterans and everything in between. A uh, good program, what I've seen so far. I've even had a little presentation myself. Yeah, well, I would encourage everybody, go as, to as many Drupal events as you can. Uh, 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 like I said, I met my girl in a Drupal event, so we usually attend quite a few Drupal events all over Europe. We actually book most of our vacations first going to DrupalCal, which the, is the event calendar for all of the Drupal events all over the world, and see, you know, hey, let's go to Spain, what's going on in Spain? So one of the things that I recommend, uh, for instance, is go to Drupal Camp Spain. This year it's going to be in Madrid, early May. So uh, look out for that. They always have an English uh, language track as well. So if you want to present or want to not so fluent in Spanish, uh, then you will still enjoy yourself. And hey, they, they know how to have some fun in the social events as well. And they have really good cooking and drinks. So recommend it.